y'all, Sarah Lou Who here, and we are back again with Tales from the Borderlands. So we are at a place called the Dome, which is another Atlas place containing one of Gordus's parts. Um, we kind of wasted the last episode just uh, driving around and then looking at uh, plants and descriptions for things because our new little Echo Eye shows us some fun stuff, shows us new little things like this because Jack's in control of our echo and information now and he apparently uh, is attracted to Fiona which I find kind of hilarious so we're just going to talk to Fiona and Athena real quick because the they're the only two place? people we didn't talk to your guess is as good as mine it's a dome I don't like it reeks of Atlas smugness and self-satisfaction what is up with her and Atlas like what's what's her deal um oh we can't talk to him anymore no no I'm not gonna go look at the worm plant all right, well, that's all that we have to talk with them about, so I guess just go over here. Like, I'm assuming this is something of important. Use gate controls. We can climb over this. Um, give me a moment. I need to let my dog out real quick. Sorry about that. She was just, she was whining to let, you yeah, know, be let out, so I, I had to. Um... All right, let's get this gate out of the way. Uh, guess it's stuck. You don't say. Let's try to move the rubble. Loaderbot. Loaderbot would be helpful here. Like, seriously? Loaderbot? Not going to help over here, buddy? It's kind of uh, your loading job. <laughs> At first, I thought it was too long to be a tie. Excuse us, Loaderbot. Then I saw it tucked into his pants, and then I had no idea what was going on. Wait a on. second. You know what it is? Okay, I can just talk to him. I was I was getting a little worried there that I was gonna control him again. Without his permission or something. Um can you move some stuff? Loader bot. Could you use a hand here, old amigo? Just need to get all this out of the way and your primary directive. <laughs> oh my god. I love Loaderbot so much. Hey. Hey. Hey, you you okay? I'm sorry about the sticky really. thing. What's wrong? I'm so sorry, bro. Do you remember back in junior year when we tried to get into that Kegatron 9000 party blowout smash? Do you remember that? No. I think a bunch of the guys that interned at Torg threw it. I have n it was uh, in refresh uh, my Turbo memory, Dorms. I guess. Well, you're going to have to refresh my memory. We went to a lot of parties. Well, one of us did. That's Aww. fine. Oh, he thinks we're being. We're in line, oh, I did... no invites, and you just say play it cool. Oh, we're becoming like the jock. Remember this but now, douche. I'm sorry, dude. Gonna let me buy and you got stuck out on the curb. Yeah, that's right. That was me. Said they'd filled their nerd quotient. Aw, fun. Yeah, didn't go we... in either. Not gonna leave my wingman behind. I'm still really mad though. I mean, you were just as much of a nerd as I was, which was hilarious, but. You look like you do, so you could fake it. Oh, well. We were both wearing hackathon shirts. You need shirts. to be more careful. Yours was uh, just all fitted and cool, yes, and mine was... Dude, you're ripped you know. as hell. You're a gorgeous yeah. human being. You look I cool, okay? I about that. I... You're just a little short really as all. Sorry. You've grown That's into it, bro. Now. You're going into it. I will say that that was the day that I realized what our friendship was destined to be forever. No! It's Reese, the cool guy. And there's Vaughn, his nerdy little best friend. Vaughn, you've now been more Gondor, cool than fucking Reese has been this entire time. I mean, hanging out with vault hunters, crazy Atlas technology, fighting insane mobsters, and, and you've just been playing it totally cool the whole time. You've been doing so I, good? I guess, look, I'm not going to get left out on the curb again, am I? No, man. I'm sorry about making you touch things. You're not that person anymore. Never again, bro. Never. Come on. It's you and me forever, bro. Just never betray her ass again. Oh, <laughs> <Aww. laughs> really my heart is warm. Honestly, I, I was all worried that you'd like, I don't know, out, outgrown me or something. Oh. Hey, that's crazy. Talk. That was so sweet. This place is just messing with your head. Let's find this gorgeous whatever and get rich, okay? Hell yeah. Oh, Let's do that's this. wonderful. Oh, that just made me so happy. <laughs> I love friendship. You good, Gordis? Not getting crushed at all? That's good. Okay, so where's the creepy part? They promised us a creepy part, and I'm excited for a creepy part. Lead the way, Gordis. 
Huh? Nice work. <laughs> oh my god. That's lovely. Loaderbot was listening the entire time. He's proud of us for not being a douche. Don't worry, we only pretend to be a douche when Jack's around. <laughs> I like the music. It's really, like, weird. Like, dainty, but... Awesome. Enchanting. What? Where are you? Ah! No, you suck. <laughs> Dummy bot does not suck. He's <laughs> precious. Made it. Entrance <laughs> this way. I love that thing. Um. All right. Get eye, dummy. All right. Let's do this. Let's see what else this place has to offer. Oh, I was controlling Fiona. I could have been insulting. I don't want to be insulting. Uh, use the door. <laughs> uh. Lovely. So what lies within? Is this the creepy part? I am so ready for the creepy part. Achieve my unlock point of no return. Well, that's reassuring. <laughs> <sighs> Anyone else's creepometer going bananas right now? Um, maybe Dumpy could scout ahead. Be brave, little Dumpy! Be bra- oh! Dumpy! I guess that means we're safe then. Thanks, Mon. <laughs> so, my upgrade's nearby! Sorry, it's kinda spooky in here. It's not really that spooky. You know, just, just dark. I'd like to search in a I can handle spooky. Is so your upgrade in this room? Fluffy towels. It's cool, spooky. it's fine. Mm. Spooky, I could handle. This room feels... I don't know. I do. It feels dangerous. What's in well, it? We know Gordis's upgrade is somewhere nearby, so let's look around in here and carefully. What's so creepy about this place? I, I, I don't. I'm not seeing the creep factor here. Hey, have you been uh? Find anything? Well, kind of. Talking to yourself this again. This place is Atlas, but it was some kind of terraforming facility. To grow plants. They were growing plants. I thought all you corporations were just about mass market destruction. I don't know, I listen pretty I'm cool, not but a corporation. And see, you learned something today. <laughs> what about Gordis' upgrade? Is it here? Um in the files yet, but a lot of it's been deleted, so that probably says something. Hmm. Clothes. What? Why are the clothes? What do you got? That's weird, right? Clothes. Looks like someone was wearing this recently. I mean, it's all burns and stuff. Is somebody living here? Ho 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 ho! That's a question. Sasha, what are you seeing, girl? Any luck? No, but Reese found out where we are. Which is? Or at least what this place was. Some kind of top secret Atlas biodome. Not much else in the system. Any sign of the Gordas upgrade? Not yet. We'll keep looking. Hmm. Oh, loot, loot, loot! Don't mind if I do. There better be moolah in there. When Fiona's around, the money's abound. Ho 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 hell yeah! <laughs> Don't mon- Uh, hello? There was a lot more in there than one stack, missy! Are you fucking kidding me? She takes one stack of all of that? What the fuck, Fiona? Um, Loderbot, Are Gordis. Are you sure your upgrade is around here? Can't you, like, give us some I'm more- I'm my energy chassis is here. Somewhere! In the general vicinity! Can't we, like, use you as a metal detector or something? We will find it. It will be glorious. <laughs> Aw, thank you. Aw. I'll just keep So looking. precious. <laughs> All right. Um, what about, what about Dumpy? What, what are you, Vaughn, what are you doing? The upgrade's in one of those melons. <laughs> uh, I'm eating these because of hunger. Are you sure they're even safe? Yeah. I know. Oh, right. Jokes. <laughs> Zing. <laughs> What the hell, Vaughn? I don't think the upgrade's in one of those melons. Okay, uh, sorry. Uh, I'm eating these. Damn. Okay, well, I guess I can't skip it, but yeah, that's weird. I know. Oh right. Well, the jokes. He's just eating random Zing. melon shaped things that he finds lying around. That seems like a terrible idea. Especially, if it's like, oh, this room is dangerous and stuff. Okay. Well, I guess if it looks like food and acts like food. Fresh fruit, in here. <laughs> Find something. Maybe like if I had found this stash. Like first. actual drake fruit? Can I have some of it? 
I Someone took a guess? bite out of the only fresh piece. So sure, if you want cooties. Huh. That's rude. I mean, even if you're living alone, you still... I don't know. It seems weird. Oh, hey, Athena, what's, what's up? Find anything? Not yet. This place is disconcerting. Is it the weird music so? going in the background? And it's Atlas. <laughs> and nothing has tried to kill us yet. Uh, let's see, what's this thingy? Wait, wait, what's this? Use quick change? Well, change into what? Anyone need some new gear? Hell yes, Any please. Weapon? No, no weapons. Let's, let's get, let's get a makeover. Interested in. Makeover time! Yay! Oh, and it costs money? Are you kidding me? Oh, that's such bull. Steampunk princess, huh? Oh, we can't even, like, turn her around. Ah, oh, this is neat! Okay, what can we do? Oh my god, we can change loader bots! Oh! And we can change the arms! I wish I had more moolah! I wish I had more money! Look how cool that would have been! Aww. Do you just get goggles, really? You and Sasha, just just goggles, huh? Okay, that's, I think, what she eventually gets, but what's this? Um... She does like her hat, though. We're not gonna take away her hat. Hmm. I How's think I look? like this. Hey guys, look at my sweet new hat! Very nice. I was kind of getting tired of your old one anyways. Well, thank you. Now we look like a badass. Seriously, why does she- why is she the only one that gets, like, full outfits? Can we take more money from the thing? Oh, I'd like to take more money from the thing. There's so much money in there! That makes me so mad that she didn't take anything. Oh, I really wanted to repaint Loaderbot, though. But he was so expensive to repaint. Like, he would've been so cool in that little tux and Atlas mustache. Atlas Extreme Latte 5000. Is it still working? Huh? What? Why? Atlas might be full of corrupt, murderous <laughs> bastards, but they made the best lattes. <laughs> uh, I mean, you could check. Nope. Aw. Ugh. Damn Atlas. <laughs> she was so great. What is it? Oh, it's moving! Whoa! Oh, bastard? What the hell? Okay, what's in here? Is there more money? Nothing here. Aw. Dang it, where are things? I want things to... Oh, map. Durr. <laughs> I mean, you have the stairs leading right up. It, it should have probably been a clear, clear thing. Damn. All right, what's this map lead us to? Is there a map of the garden? The technical term for this is highly goddamn suspicious. What's that? Map. What, what, what kind of map? Map of the garden, it looks like. Unclear. There's little plants on it. The markings on it seem... Deliberately obscure. Oh, how fun! Like a treasure hunt map! Uh, yeah, gorgeous, something like that. <laughs> so fresh, just little but baby. But it doesn't appear to lead to anything, so... I doubt it has anything to do with your upgrades. We should still follow it! I vote following it! This is weird. I think someone's been living here. Don't Probably. worry so much. Maybe he'll be nice. Or she! Could always be a she. Nothing else out there? Should, should we... Oops. Gordis? What's wrong? Gordis? Who the fuck what? are you? Get away from Gordis. Don't kill me. Question mark? No idea. Please, please don't kill me. I, I, I've just been watching you. Just, just watching, that's all. I swear, I am completely harmless. There okay. is absolutely no need for you to kill me. Okay. I, I We're not here you. to hurt you, Everything I assume? Okay. Be I, I don't even know who you are. Us, we're not here to hurt you. Thank you for that. It is genuinely rare to encounter reasonable, somewhat intelligent seeming people. Okay, that's nice. Why is Gordis afraid of you, though? That little robot's why we're here. There's an upgrade somewhere nearby. We're looking for it. Well, I, I, I can't help you with that. I know nothing about it. You totally so know something you about it. Leave. We all should leave, all of us, going our separate ways. I uh -huh. can do it right now, in fact. And if what are you hiding, asked, dude? <laughs> not that anyone would, of course. Well, I, you're I'll being super I'll suspicious. Say, I didn't see you. <laughs> All right, Is something coming things. to kill us? Your A, really weird, and B, obviously hiding something. What is it? I, I just, I, I, um... You, what? 
Very well, young lady. You win. Uh, that doesn't seem good. I'm on the run, you see. I have lost everything. My wife. My son. My cat. Not the cat. I did not lose them in that order, though. I, I lost my wife first, then my cat, then my son. So, okay. wife, cat, son. <laughs> You what are you running a from, dude? Storyteller, because I gotta tell you, your sense for crucial information is just. Reese. Yeah, don't be a douche, dude. Forgive me. <laughs> it's been a long time since I've enjoyed Aww. human contact. Uh, perhaps I've forgotten how to talk to people. It's okay, dude. You must understand. I've suffered months of wandering, isolation. Skulking from one location to the next. Yeah. Broken, okay. ashamed, okay. homeless. I got here to this place only minutes ago. Well, I mean, so, there's plenty of room in our caravan. We're just grabbing new people I'd every ask time. You leave me now. Why don't you come along? Demons and go. No, he's just trying to get us to leave for something. What are you hiding? He's hiding That's something. That's a sad story, but I still don't You've mapped him. this facility. The me fruit's neither. been here. I do. Your clothes are in the corner? What does that have to do with Clothes? clothes? You're gonna tell me it's not yours? It's the exact same outfit you're wearing right now. Dun dun dun. Or is that just an odd coincidence? You know, you seem like an intelligent man. Thank you. I am. You've probably okay. figured out by so... now that the easiest way to end all this and get rid of us is simply tell the truth. Oh, so we were just trying to I'll like prove that he had been know. here for a while. Follow me. Finally. I am. Um, not a simple traveler. Okay. In that jungle. I suspect it contains the upgrade you're looking for. Are you looking for it too? I wish I could tell you more about what's inside, but I was never brave enough to check. The problem, mm. your problem, is the Atlas automated security system that surrounds said bunker. Is it a Isn't lot of guns? Right? If I were you... Because we can deal with guns. In this instance, I'm relieved I am not. I'd gain access to the security tower, which is... There. Or we could just let Jack do things again. <laughs> I can get in that and seems to work the security well. systems. Easy. Not easy. Not at all easy. But we took over an Atlas base works. last time, so. An automated security system, huh? Can Hyperion hack uh, the system? Just realize the acronym. You've really for that never been ass. there. Ha! Yeah, that's what the fuck why no one calls it that. <laughs> hey, Reese. Why guess we're kind of defense We're gonna disable there. Atlas's ass. <laughs> yes, 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 we are. <laughs> Do you think Reese can handle oh, hacking into those security systems? Spawn. Please, in my sleep. Because overconfidence has never gotten you into trouble before. So Wait, we're done we can talking, do it. Then? We can actually go secure this upgrade now? Yeah, totally. Fiona, Let's go. While Mr. Robot Eye here hits the security tower, God, and she looks so defenses, cool now. <laughs> you and I will infiltrate the bunker and grab the upgrade. Let's okay. Get this gorgeous piece and get Are out of here, huh? Be it you sweet. Let's <laughs> do it. This is Give incredible. me a shield to chuck at things. Confidence. That's good. Yay. <laughs> I'll go with Reese to make sure he doesn't get into any trouble. Yeah, that's it's why. It's a simple hack. You want to know how simple? I look at it and it hacks. No need to put yourself in danger. We took over a bunch of <laughs> freaking robots me, aiming to kill us. Food. Hmm. How many times now? You need me. August would have shot you in the face if it wasn't for us. So, mm. Yeah. Take that. <laughs> uh, she's got a point, though. They've saved our butts yeah, more than we've yeah. saved theirs. So, uh, I'm just going to be here uh, hurting and doing stuff if anyone needs me. It's okay, Vaughn. There's a lot of stuff I can do, right? Huh? Search these computers for info. Keep your uh, eye on that guy. I Escort us about her upgrades. Assassin. Uh, get some info, I guess. Charming, but, you but you, I got, you got skills. Yeah, I got faith in you, dude. Yeah, I got a job for you. Use the computers in here and find out whatever you can about Atlas, Gordas, or the vaults. I think Loaderbot probably the has right uh, the scientist guy covered. I'm assuming he's a scientist. He seems like one. He's very tech right. heavy. Everyone knows what they're doing. Seems to yeah. know what he does. And with a plan like this, what could possibly go wrong? Indeed, what could go wrong? Except for everything. But I'm assuming scientist because he so had... One moment, my... let me pause this. I'm assuming scientist, though, because, like, he has these burns all over that suit thing. We're at the end of the... We're just about at the end of the episode anyway, so I'm probably going to just cut it here before we get into the rest of it. But, um, yeah, no, he has, like, those burn marks all over the suit thing. You know, the clothes that he had discarded. Then you have all this stuff mapped out. You have all of the computers, which seem to be active, which suggests, would suggest that he's, you know, working on them. 
And then you have the weird little plant, and I don't think that just came about naturally. And why would he just, you know, go and uproot some weird, vicious little plant if he didn't have, you know, some purpose for it, or if he wasn't the one who made it? You know, it just seems like a crazy scientist thing. Plus, he has all that gear on his head. It just seems like the logical conclusion there. But, um, yeah, no, the question is... How do we get more money to get more cool outfits? No, that's not the question. The question is, um, how are we going to... What what makes this, you know, such an intense place? Because, you know, in the future they're looking back on this and they're going, Oh yeah, that was like super creepy and stuff. And then it's, it's like, well, if it's super creepy, where is the creepy part coming in? I'm assuming it has something to do with the defense system, and I'm assuming it's going to be a lot more difficult than just letting, you know, Handsome Jack hack the system like he did before to control the robots at the previous Atlas base. So, could it be something to do with the plants? What if, oh, what if that little tiny plant was foreshadowing? What if we are actually going to run into a giant one of those? That would be interesting. But yeah, okay, this is where we're going to end the episode. Um, so we've, run out, we've run out of time, but uh, <laughs> yeah, no, it's really cool. It's really cool so far, like, you know, just seeing all the interesting stuff and I'm I'm just really curious as to where it's building up to. Like, I don't feel like we actually got that far in this episode, but um, we're getting somewhere. We're getting somewhere with it all. So we'll, we'll um, see what happens in the next episode. If we actually do run into one of those freaky plant things, I really hope we do, because that would be the only thing that would explain the creepy factor to me. Because I can just see, you know, like, vines creeping in the background and stuff, you know, alien style. <laughs> But, um, yeah, that's it for this episode, so, you know, like, and subscribe if you want to. Next time, we're going to see if any of these theories of mine are actually true or not, and, uh, yeah. So, thank you for watching! <laughs>